hi welcome to my channel in case you're new here my name is miss rumbo and thank you for clicking on this video i make videos about fashion beauty law culture and everything in between all that fancy stuff i hope you consider joining this family and to join this family all you have to do is hit the subscribe button and turn on the notification bell beside it in order to know anytime i upload a video and if you have already joined this family welcome back so today's video i want to rumble a lot and i'm just feeling some type of a way first of all i'm so nervous i'm excited i a lot of things are going on and you know i wanted just to take this opportunity to take a breather you know and just talk to you guys on a heart to heart level and uh i hope i don't rumble too much so yeah keep on watching <sighs> so guys the reason why i'm standing today before you guys it's because we have hit the 500 subscriber milestone and that is just making me so proud and so happy and you know i have to share these feelings with you guys because it's not my doing it's you guys I mean, apart from me doing the work of uh, of shooting editing and uploading uh you guys make it a success by just watching liking commenting and sharing so guys today's video before i start on what i wanted to say is just to say thank you guys no amount of words can really really express the kind of emotion i mean i feel like that you compose because i've learned to compose myself i don't want to be all over the place so guys from the bottom of my heart thank you and i hope continue with me on this journey okay so today i wanted uh us to talk about what youtube has taught to me so far it has been amazing six months and uh in this span of time trust me i've learned a lot so here are a few things that i've learned the first and the most important one is confidence i have learned be really confident like you can see that from my first video my 10th video to my 20th video and now my 37th video like you can tell the progress of how you know i present myself to you guys and all that guys my confidence level <laughs> we are graduating what do you think 100 percent i'll be talking like a presenter like in a bit yellow like yeah welcome to the kitchen news like yeah that kind of confidence Woo! yeah you decided we're keeping it in check okay perfect so the second thing i've learned from youtube is patience patience is paramount and i'm not just saying this i have experienced it and this is what i had in my mind when i started my youtube channel i actually had a very high hope of growing really fast because of my instagram following i have quite a number of followers on my instagram so i was just like it's gonna be easy i'm just gonna go there and announce that i'm i have a youtube channel and you know people will you know come over but to my disappointment it doesn't work that way because youtube and instagram are two different platforms yes there are social media and all that but you actually have to earn trust for these people you know to move over to this youtube channel because one major factor for that is be, i do diff, two different contents on my youtube is more of inspiring educating and all that the educative stuff and on my instagram is more of the fun and keeping people happy alive and all that so these two uh were two different things so i had I have learned to be very patient with everyone and give them the time, you know, to process that change, you know, and for them to decide like, wow, so she's on YouTube. So this is the kind of content she's doing. Is this the content that I love? So yes, I'm going to follow her for more. So yeah, 
I have learned that it takes time and I have to be patient with that. The third thing I have learned from YouTube is being hardworking. And it's just like any other job. So all these successful people will tell you to be successful, you have to put God first, believe in yourself, and then put in the work. Do you know, like in every single minute or every single second, a thousand videos are being uploaded on YouTube. And when they ukika hapo, like you're lazing around, like imagine so yeah i am learning that you know ata sijaanza kufanya hiyo kazi because right now i upload once in a week sometimes twice in a week time na feeling you know the response is great and still that is not much work done because uh youtube youtube is like a social media where people have fun, you know, you educate each other, there is that. As much as all that is uh, happening, you have to understand that it, it is also a business. So you have to try and be consistent because actually no one is going to take you serious if you upload today, then upload three months later, and then another four months later. So for all that three months. So it has really taught I mean you wake up on the right lane, I can say that. Because you know, I can wake up today and I'm like, wow. You know, I need to think about the next content. I need, you know, to plan out what I'm gonna serve you guys. You know, it is just putting me out there and I'm just loving this journey, honestly, because I used to be so lazy. Now I have a purpose. And for that, I'm so grateful for YouTube and you guys, of course. The fourth thing I have learned from YouTube is uh, to be, how, how do I put this character trait? I would say understanding, I, I don't know, to have that heart of taking in every single response, whether it's uh, negative or positive, I don't know what that character trait is but i'm learning it like uh, for you to be out there you're gonna receive the love and the hatred so you just need to know how to respond to all these uh, negative vibes positive vibes and all that so i'm learning to weigh you know so that the hatred doesn't weigh you down because the love is there to give you hope faith you know and all that and to give you the support you need and the hatred is there to steer you you know give you uh, the pressure to work you know they say that if you don't receive any hate then there is nothing you're doing so <laughs> yeah the hate has to be there and i'm learning to deal with all that so it's actually a process so that is still under process um, and I'm so glad that YouTube is a platform where I can learn to deal with people. So yeah, that is the fourth point. My demons is in a talk of cocoon, but <laughs> number five is actually something that you can see like from the very start to start like oh language skills. Yo nowadays I speak frequently you know wow this much english <laughs> even me i'm surprised by the way i think it goes hand in hand with being composed and confident and now that i have this platform then i can display all those skills and last but not least youtube has taught me to be very understanding you know, I'm talking about this, I'm talking about disappointments because I have been disappointed a lot and it's going to take so much understanding, so much tolerance. I'm, you know, still learning to take no for an answer. I'm still learning to take, you know, something I've learned, like honestly, something I've learned is that every video is different on its own. So one might pick up once, like the moment you upload it, it will... <laughs> you know pick up na kuna zile zenye zitaka na full views like for hours and then it will pick up later so these ones that pick up really slowly are the ones that really kill you inside and uh, you know, if uh, you're a business person or you're and you're selling just one thing a day you know what i mean by that 
the disappointment can weigh you down and i'm learning to keep the hope alive i'm learning to be very understanding that not every video will do well so you know the first disappointment that i got was from this video a day as a hawk like i put in so much work on that video I've ne i had never planned for a video the way i had planned for that video and you know when i uploaded it and after 24 hours i i only had like 26 views guys that really killed me and i was like hey, youtube is not for me i swear and i remember i was just you know gonna take a break like i was just like a month or two months old on youtube and i was there like saying i'm gonna take a break and then this babe pauline she comments she shows me the love she if there is one person that is really steering me towards the direction of you know keep on going keep on going it's that girl like she'll show you love even on the videos that you know you've done nothing like basically not really nothing like you haven't given it your best she's there to encourage shout out to you girl i love you so much you already know this thank you i'm i'm so grateful to have you in my life and really what gets me by is the kind words from you guys like even if you don't have to comment you can like the video because if i see like so many people are liking this content it gives me hope like wow i'm actually doing something great here i'm actually onto something so it gives you the inspiration it gives you the motivation and all that so i'm so glad that i have that kind of support youtube is like any other business kutakwana rainy days na kutakwana the drought now you have to be very uh, prepared and understanding for the drought kind of days and um for that i mean not every video is gonna do well and um, you know it will take a lot of understanding for you to take a lot of tolerance but that has to be there i've learned that that has to be there like see killer video it will na everyone kila mtu akona test yake like ata feel kama that this yeah that mm -mm. And you know, you just have to just take it a day at a time. And if something that doesn't do well, then you have to be okay with that too. And you know, as I told you before, it's a journey and I'm learning all these things. And actually, I don't have to give myself that much pressure. I can only do what I can only do and the rest is up to you. So yeah, I need to work on that also because it's a work in progress. So I know I can talk all day if given the platform, but we're not going to talk all day. So thank you for listening to me. Thank you for supporting. Thank you for watching. Thank you for the kind words you guys give me all the time. Thank you for everything. Thank you for subscribing. Thank you for keeping it locked with me. And I promise that you are not going to regret believing in me, supporting me, because I'm going to give it my all in every single video that I'm going to upload from now on. You know, quarantine is happening and I think I have all the all that time you know to plan content and shoot content and i'm gonna take advantage of that and just put in the work you know so that you guys don't feel like your support is going to waste so, guys thank you so much for holding my hand thank you and thank you for watching this video till next time hey i love you